reds as well. That was smart. Go wander off. Oh my god, all the reds are coming. Oh my god. They're looking for survival. Oh my god. Welcome everyone to another movie reaction. My name is Jeroen, better known as Dutch Pawn Fan, and I'm once again rejoined by my lovely girlfriend Lirit. Hi! Today we are watching 1989's Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. Another first time watching for us, the third yeah. Indiana Jones movie. Uh, what are your hopes and expectations for this one? I think it's very different than the last one. Um, it's a surprise for me, so yeah. <laughs> I hope a lot of action. Yeah, uh, and a lot of spiders and snakes. No, nope. <laughs> <laughs> no, no monkey heads, no monkey brains, <laughs> no eyeball soup, nothing. Oh, I don't want that. Soup, yeah. <laughs> no. I'm mainly looking forward to see uh, Sean Connery in this movie. I know he's in this. I can't wait to see his performance in this. I also know there's going to be another actor uh, that we haven't seen yet that is from a Bond movie we've watched recently. I know which actor is in there. I don't know what kind of role he plays, so it's still going to be a surprise to me as well. I just know about this particular actor and I won't spoil it to you. Let's see if you spot him. So it's we... a him. I spoiled it as a him, yeah, from For Your Eyes Only. That's all I'm gonna say from the previous uh, movie reaction. So it's still fresh in your mind, hopefully, because it hasn't been that long since we uh, watched that movie. Um, anyway, if you are interested in watching the full-length reaction of me and Lyrit watching The Last Crusade, then you can join me on my Patreon page where all premium supporters can watch the whole thing there, synchronized with their own copy of the movie. So, um, without any further ado, we're going to be jumping into our first time watching The Last Crusade. Looks like an American desert. Oh, do you see that mountain with the rock? It's like Wally Coyote from uh, Meep Meep Looney Tunes. <laughs> Julian Glover, that's the name of the actor, but you wouldn't know still who it was right now. But he's the guy returning. Uh, that was also in For Your Eyes Only, I meant. And Sean Connery. Oh, they're Boy Scouts. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the fat one fell. <laughs> Sorry. Is that Indiana Jones? That's Indiana Jones. It's uh, not. It's the bad guy. Probably. What are they doing? <gasps> That's Indy. Indiana. So it's back in time. Yeah. What What are you gonna do? Thank you, something. He looks like almost like Leonardo DiCaprio. Yeah. I know it's not him, but. Mr. Havelock! Anybody? Everybody's lost but me. But where is his group? They're all gone. At least he's got his horse. Oh my god. <laughs> what is faster? A car or a horse? Well, apparently in those days, a horse. Are those real giraffes? I don't think so. I don't know. Oh, it's circus train. Oh my god! Reptiles! Oh god, this is where he gets his phobia. Ah! Ah! Oh, here are the snakes. So this is why he's scared of them. Really close. 
It's with the lions. I think with the lions. Yeah, of right. course! Of course! Toss up the web! Uh, it's a magic box. Like a trick box. Yes. But they do have respect for him. Dad! Oh. What's important? And wait. Count to 20. No, Dad, you listen. Junior! You hear the voice? No. Count to 20. Story of his life. In the oh, that's how he became. <laughs> you think he's going to fall overboard? I don't know. <laughs> oh, no, there it goes. <laughs> The ship was called Corona. So forget any ideas you got. All oh, girls, of course. Did you know the first movie? Yeah, same thing again. Except that I love you. On the eyelids. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to escape out the window. I don't blame him. Oh, uh, they're not dead. Trust your trip down. There he is. Who's that? For your eyes only, remember? Look from, from close. Mr. Donovan? I know who you are, Mr. Oh, Donovan. Oh, was that not the bad guy? Or the years of an yeah. Chris Dottles? Some of the pieces in your... We already have. Your father is the man who has disappeared. Oh! But he didn't know. So he has to look to his own father. Yeah. While well, also... Being on a search for the Holy Grail. Yeah. Oh, the door is open. Dad! Dad! Yeah, God. Huh? It's the old fool. Someone broke in? Got himself. It's Dad's Grail Diary. Every clue he followed, every discovery he made, a complete record of his search for the Holy Grail. Good luck. I'll be very careful. Don't trust anybody. I don't think you can even trust him. No. It's like, like for your eyes only. Maybe it's something similar again. Well, how will we recognize this Dr. Schneider when we see him? I don't know. Maybe he'll know us. Dr. Jones? Yes. Marcus Brody? That's right. Dr. Elsa Schneider? How do you do? He <laughs> was a guy. Him. It's a... Uh, a woman. <laughs> three. Three. Seven. Seven. Ten. And ten. Now where's the ten? Oh, well, he's going upstairs. Oh, he's gonna see it from above. Oh, the whole thing is a big axe. Oh, it's quite obvious. <laughs> <laughs> X marks the spot. <gasps> He's going to break it? Now, this can't be it. It's too easy. It's too obvious. Oh, Einstein's here as well. But he's come to smack. <laughs> <laughs> the guy thought it was his step. <laughs> <laughs> this has gotta be a trap. This is too easy. It's a grave, a tomb. It is the actual tomb. Look after this for me. Why? It's the most he's, important he, thing. Yeah, just like with the cross, he's always so trustworthy. Right? All that he can li literally lock these two people off. Yeah. Now. Petroleum. I should sink a well down here and retire. 
Well, she better look out with the fire then. Oh, rats. Oh, here we go again. A whole bunch of them. <laughs> no. Oh! Oh! You gotta love Indiana Jones movies. No. <laughs> They're in water, or in, or they're in uh, what, what's it? Petrol. I, I guess. That's what they. What, that's what he said. So I'd be careful with the fire, but all the sparks are coming off the fire too. So that already would be a problem if this was petrol. Wouldn't it be wonderful if you were here now to see this? <laughs> never would have made it past the rats. <laughs> he hates rats. He's oh no, they're going to set it on fire. They, they look like um, Turkish people, the Ottomans. Yeah. Oh, oh the rats as well. <laughs> that was smart. Don't wander off. They're looking oh for my god! <laughs> oh my god! Find a way out! Deep breath! This is something like Roger Moore's Bond could do. Yes. Oh, we get another boat chase in Venice. Of course! Italian job, Moonraker, <laughs> and now the Last Crusade. Are you crazy? Don't go between them! Go between them! Are you crazy? She misunderstood. Oh no. Oh no, they're gonna be crushed. No. Ooh. Just in time. They are gonna be crushed. This doesn't look like Venice anymore, though. No. They're like in the outskirts of the industrial part or something. Oh my god, there he is, there he is. Why are you trying to kill us? Oh my I would have uh, I would have let him die. Of course you would. <laughs> Ford had been prepared to do anything to keep it safe. Uh, so they're protectors. What protectors? They they put the whole place on fire. Yeah. Yes, now we know. Marcus, get hold of Sala. Tell him to meet. Sala. Sala. Yeah. Another actor from Bond. Uh, you still need to see that movie, but <sighs> this is like Goldfinger. Yeah. It's just like a um, uh, James Bond movie, but yeah. Well, that's a. Oh, they know castle. exactly at which castle at the border. Well. If it were me, this was, would have been the first one I would start. It looks so sinister, there's thunderstorm over it, like, yeah, that, that should be it. <laughs> Do you intend to leave us standing on the doorstep all day with the rain? That gun and caught a sniffle. Are a you sniffle? <laughs> there he is! Who's this? Sean Connery. You, Junior. Don't call me that, please. Well, what are you doing here? It's Sean Connery, babe. But he doesn't look like Sean Connery. He does. No. Have you never seen what Connery looks like when he's old? No. Oh, he looks like this. Uh, not that old, but. Well, I'm sorry about your head, though. Sorry about your head, though. Yeah, they come in through the door. <laughs> <laughs> Good point. <laughs> Dr. Jones. Yes. yes. <laughs> Do you think my son would be that stupid? Yes. He would bring my diary all the way back here. Yeah. He would. <laughs> you didn't, did you? <laughs> yep. You didn't bring it, did you? Well, uh, you did. <laughs> Trust me. I will kill her. Huh? Go ahead. No! 
<laughs> Go ahead. He won't. Indy, please do what he says. And don't listen to her. What is she doing? But you should have listened to your father. She is a Nazi. How did you know she was a Nazi? Hmm? How did you know she was a Nazi? She talks in sleep. <laughs> Who is that, Blofeld? Uh, yeah, he's a bad guy as well. I knew it. Just like Bond. <laughs> I trust anybody, Dr. Jones. See, that was yeah. too easy to guess. You'll never see him again. With any luck, he's got the grill already. Uh, does anyone here speak English? He'll blend right in. Mr. <laughs> Sarah. Oh, oh, yeah, that's Sarah. Of course. <laughs> Run. Yes. Ravens, I've yeah. got it here. <laughs> Just finished reading it myself. <laughs> Run. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> he burned himself. Oh my god, it's going to set on fire! Oh my god! They're making it worse for themselves. Oh my god! Oh, great. <laughs> He's not James Bond anymore! You get sentimental now, Dad. Save it till we get out of here. The floor is on fire. See? <laughs> and the trap. Uh -oh. One second. Nine. Oh my god. Six. Five. I'm a Oh, this is great. <laughs> Over there. there! I find that if I just sit down and think... Uh, it's a staircase. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the solution presents itself. <laughs> they have to wait until they're gone. Yeah. Oh, what a great Just escape. too early. <laughs> Connery's face. <laughs> Connery's like, we should have taken the boat. <laughs> oh, God. He's taking the flash post. Connery's not laughing. <laughs> We're going the wrong way. We have to get to Berlin. Brody's this way. My diary's in Berlin. But I found the clues that will safely take us through in the Chronicles of St. Ansel. Well, what are they? I don't know. <laughs> it's in the diary. <laughs> it's in the diary. I wrote them down in my diary so that I wouldn't have to remember. <laughs> the German army's on our tail and you... The diary better not be in that pile of books. All I have to do is squeeze. All I have to do is squeeze. Ooh. I don't know, so what is she? Is she a bad guy, a good guy? She just wants to grill. Can she be trusted? What do you think? No. <laughs> oh, there he is. It's, it's Adolf himself. Oh, my God.
my god. Talking about... Oh, it just gave a signature. Yeah. <sighs> now it, it, now it has a lot history. of historical um, value though. With his signature in there. Oh, the Zeppelin. The Zeppelin. Germany behind us, then I'll share that sentiment. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no ticket. <laughs> <laughs> I bet they're gonna be flying in the little plane at some point to escape or something. Oh, yes. I like this movie a lot so far. What about you? Yes. This is great. Sharing a trenches. Did I ever tell you to eat up, go to bed, wash your ears, do your homework? No, I respected your privacy and I taught you self reliance. <laughs> what you taught Self reliance. Huh, I'm here now. <clears throat> what do you want to talk about? Well, then what are you complaining about? Be <laughs> in the leap from the lion's head, will he prove his worth? What does that mean? I don't know. <laughs> he nodded, like, okay. You get it? Yeah. Of course, the airplane. Yeah, there they go. Oh god, in a Nazi plane as well. Oh god. Now it became a lot like Bond again. Have to use the, machine the machine gun! gun. What happens at 11 o'clock? <laughs> well, 11 time, 11 o'clock, fire! Oh no! He's shooting his own tail! Are we hit? Yeah. More or less. John, I'm sorry. They got us. They got us. <laughs> This was all Connery's fault. Yeah, but he's not that smart in this movie. Well, but I like him. Yeah. Oh, here we are! People are trying to kill us. I know, Dad! It's a new experience for me. It happens to me all the time. <laughs> yeah. This is insane. Holy shit. Faster boy, faster! Well, they don't come any closer than that. <laughs> Dad! He's coming back. <laughs> Dad, he's going back! That is Striper. smart. Bird strike. Bird strike. Yeah. Oh, they found Salah. Get down. Dad, we're well out of range. Nope. <laughs> 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 the cup of life holds everlasting damnation. She has to know him from Venice. Yeah. Schnell! Schnell! Oh, more not 
Nazi is great. <laughs> This is a thing! This is a thing! This is a thing! Ah! 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 Kill him already! Yes! All he has to do now is jump off. Jump, jump off! No, he's already off the tank. He's heading, heading here. Yeah. I just wasn't ready, Marcus. Five minutes would have been enough. Yeah. I got five minutes. <laughs> what are you looking at? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I'd lost you, boy. Oh. How did he? <laughs> They're like, how? Well done. Come on. Well done. He's tired. Let's go then. How did they got all those horses? Is it a Jordanian? How do you... Uh, why? Because of Petra. Jordan? Yes, in Jordan. What is he doing? I don't know. Oh, they're, they're not scared. Ooh, he's beheaded. Yeah. Ew, spiders! Spider webs! There, there aren't any actual spiders yet. They'll probably appear. And there goes his head. Oh. Helmet, another volunteer. Another volunteer. Hey, Dr. Jones, you're absolutely right. <gasps> no! No! Dad. Dad! Oh, no. I didn't know this was gonna oh, happen. No! Now he has to try and get yes. it. Yes. But there are three... What? Three courses or like yeah. tasks to do. Yeah. Penitent man. Penitent man is humble. Kneels before God. Kneels! <gasps> that was what he, he needed to kneel. Yeah. Jehovah begins with an I. J. He didn't know that. <laughs> Latin Jehovah starts with an I. I. E. All right, now the third challenge. What was it again? And you must hurry. Come quickly. Yeah, but how? A leap. <gasps> Where? What is he standing on? Nothing. Now oh, it's, it's optical illusion. Faith. You see? Optical illusion. What's this? 
Who are you? The last of three brothers who swore an oath to find oh. the grail and to guard it. How did they get here so easily? They they followed him, right? Oh yeah. And he did like sand over it. That's stupid. I have no idea what it looks like. Which one is it? Let me choose. Thank you, Doctor. She's one of the good guys. Yeah, but she's gonna choose the bad one for him, I think. Is he going to die or? He's back. We have got it. Come on. Oh. Elsa. Elsa, don't move. It's ours, Indy. Yours and mine. There it goes. Lost forever. Probably. Down blonde. Ah. Greedy. 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 Greet. Bye. Junior, give me your other hand. I can't hold on. I can Great! Don't do the same mistake. Indiana. Whoa. The whole movie he didn't yeah. set Indiana. Let go. But he wanted it for his dad, not for himself. But his dad wanted his son's yeah. life more. That's symbolic. When your father says your old name, yeah. then you know he loves you. Yeah. Then it's serious. <laughs> yeah. What does it always mean? Is this Junior? That's his name. Henry Jones Junior. Like Indiana. We named the dog Indiana. <laughs> Maybe go home now. <laughs> you are named after the dog. <laughs> <laughs> Got a lot of fond memories of that dog. Yes, sir. <laughs> Wow, yeah. This was my favorite one. I think so, yeah. You? I think the second one. Yeah. Of course. That was the most horror movie like. Yes. We finished watching The Last Crusade. Um, what are your initial thoughts? Yeah, it's a pretty good movie. Yeah. A lot of action. I agree. I think this is the most fun I've had uh, with an Indiana Jones movie yet, and I really like the other two as well. Yeah. But this one, uh, this one was great. Once again, we did our separate ratings, um, <laughs> and we did not look at each other's scores. Shall we just delve into them right away? Okay. So the main character, Harrison Ford, playing Indiana Jones once again. What did you give him? Four stars. Four stars. Yeah. I gave him five stars this five? time. Five? Five, okay. yes. I think he deserves the full mark. <laughs> um, do you want to start? He did a pretty good job. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Anything else to add or? Mm, no. Okay, well I think I gave him five stars because I feel his comedic timing was spot on, his chemistry with, with Connery in particular was really good. Uh, he was a lot of fun to watch. Uh, this was definitely the funniest I feel he was compared yeah. to the other three. So uh, I feel that's why Harrison Ford gets the five stars this time around. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So we move on to the next category. <laughs> Moving on. 
Okay, we're moving on to the supporting cast. What did you give the supporting characters? Four stars. I went with five once again. again. Yeah. Just five because stars. of Connery, right? I could be biased, yes. you know. I, I, <laughs> you're the first to catch me on that. Maybe I am. But I, I gave it some thought beforehand. Like, okay, so I know Connery is going to be in this. Am I going to be that guy that just gives him five stars regardless of what he's doing? But I thought Connery was really good in this. He was, I he, he was even really funny. That it was yeah, that was embarrassing. <laughs> You know, most people, so most people only see old man Connery and they don't recognize him being young because you mostly only see him as Bond and being young. You know, some some people our age never seen Connery as a young guy. They only see him with the with the gray beard. And you were like, is that Connery? So you've never seen the old. No, I thought he was like starring like that. Yeah, there's a poster movie. in in our house uh, of Connery. No, this is 89. He was a bit older back then. Um, which immediately brings me to a promise that I have to show her the movie The Rock now. Give me a thumbs up in the comments if you <laughs> agree with me. We have to show her Connery's the, the Rock. Is he then old? Or yeah, it's, it's, made, it's made a few years after this movie. I think 94. Oh, then he's old. Yeah. But he's great in it as well. It's uh, okay. and it's it's a sort of a bond related movie really we can do. I didn't recognize him in this movie. But but later in the close-ups, you must admit the eyes, the accent. But of course, you know. It, it, you... Some words I was like, oh yes, that's Connery. Yeah. But like only with this. Yeah, his with eyes have never changed, eyes? and the eyebrows, of course. Mm, yeah, but the rest. Yeah. Well, we need to educate her on what Sean Connery is like in, in his later movies, so uh, we definitely <laughs> are going to move into The Rock. But uh, you haven't talked about why you gave four stars to the supporting characters yourself. Well, I thought it was very high. Yeah, so explain, just explain your reasoning. Uh, I gave them all one star. <laughs> so there are four supporting characters? I think so. Sean Connery, Sala, uh, that dumb guy and well the girl was supposedly the bad guy but she's also the good guy girl so 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 you're telling the viewers and, you only gave one star the, to connery and, and then you just added with every and, star but there's also like the the army with the cross here mm -hmm. yeah yeah they were kind of helping um but did you like the performance of, of uh, the, those characters? Yes, but Sean Connery, uh, I knew him from James Bond, like um, the badass guy who gets like the girls and like action and stuff. And he, in this movie, he was like a dumb father. Well, he was also intelligent in, in a lot yes, of ways. In and a his lot intuition of ways. But he was also like a father. <laughs> Yeah, like, and and you know, junior. Yeah, you know the fun <laughs> trivia. Sean Connery was only a few years older in this movie than Harrison Ford. He could have never been the father in real life. He was only a few years older. Really? But the, you know the beard made him look a lot older. Oh, but so he actually wasn't. The beard was fake. No, no, no. It's his beard. He he had a beard from that age, but he was only a few years older than Harrison Ford. Oh. So you know if he if if this these were. Then in real life, Connery would have had him when he was like seven or something. I think he's like eight or oh. seven years old. I should look up the birth year of uh, Harrison Ford, Harrison, but I know Connery is from 1930. Harrison Ford, he looks very young then. Yeah, and maybe Connery a bit older. Yeah. Connery stopped aging from this point onwards, because now you see him in 89, you can watch a movie from 20 years later, like 2009, and he'll look the same. So he stopped aging at some point. He aged really rapidly at my age. When he became Bond, he was also 31. And he looked a lot older. But, na but now, he, at later age, he stopped aging. And the guy remained a sexy guy for the rest of his life. <laughs> In my opinion. In your opinion. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to uh, continue because we're, um, we're going a little bit digressing. We're digressing a little bit here. Uh, moving on to the villains. What did you give them? You first. I gave them three stars. Mm. What about you? Two. 
stars. Two stars. I did that for the second movie. Okay, shall I start this time? Yeah. Uh, the villains were a lot weaker, I think. And again, it was Julian Glover that was Chris Tados in our previous movie reaction for mm -hmm. For Your Eyes Only. I, I was expecting him to be the double-cross dude again like he did in For Your Eyes Only, <laughs> so I wasn't surprised he was the villain. Um, I think some guys in the comments on For Your Eyes Only foreshadowed it. One guy said he plays a similar role, so I was kind of expecting he would be a villain, and he was. And he was kind of similar to Free Your Eyes Only, wasn't he? He doesn't really stand out that no. much like in Free Your Eyes Only. Yeah. The um, same. Yeah, but there's other villains. The Nazis are back again. Um, I did like the, the girl, Elsa, um, her performance because you really start to hate her near the end. And then, then there's the intrigue or what is he? Is he good or bad? There's a nuance to her character that. She is kind of good, but also greedy. Mm -hmm. the, that, so I liked it. So I think that's why I gave the three stars, because she was one of the more memorable ones. What about you? It was the same as the first one, Nazis. Yeah, this yeah. takes place right after the first one, pretty much. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> and you prefer and the, the five-star villain from the Temple of Doom, where uh, it's like the guys that... that Tore out the heart. And yeah, it's the... like a cult thing or yeah. something. Not just the Nazis. They're all in all movies, just like the first one. Yeah. But now they have like more things of Nazis in this movie. Mm -hmm. And you had Hitler in. This yeah, movie Hitler also. appeared in it as well. And um, yeah. yeah, yeah, that was, I was fun. Not impressed. Okay, yeah, and I agree, the villains are um, one of the more weaker things, but Elsa yeah, is the one to remember. Yeah, she got under my skin. But that's what makes her a good actress, yeah. if she achieves that, you know. But the rest not. <laughs> Alright, so, moving on to uh, the lo locations, right? Yeah, the locations of this movie. I gave the locations yeah. four stars. Me too, four, four stars. stars. So this is the one we agree on. You can start this time around. Yeah, beautiful locations. I agree. Yeah. Yeah, um, you, you picked up that the one in the end is probably in Jordan. Yeah. The, um, what was it called again? Uh, Petra. Yeah, I think it was. We should look it up. We did not do I any did research. I did it. Yeah. It's, it's, I looked it up. But if it's the one in the movie as well, I, I'm pretty sure it is. I think so, yeah. yes. Um, and even if you don't, you don't necessarily see all the the everything no i'm oh, sorry okay and there was also venice yeah uh which i really liked i was thinking it might have been featured more because when it gets to the boat chase mm -hmm. you don't really see much of venice no, anymore it just no. goes to the outskirts it, it may have I been filmed so. somewhere else yes maybe they couldn't film in venice at that at that, that time or something because they only they did they were actually in venice in like the the inner city but the boat chase Maybe we're used to Moonraker and the Italian job where they go do oh, go yes, through the actual yeah. canals. Here it was just they went to a boatyard. It was still I think so, yeah. impressive. But overall, the movie just looked good, all the locations, I feel. And they did a fantastic job. So much action sequences in it as well. Underneath the church in Venice, that yes. was cool with the, with the petrol <laughs> and the rats. And the, the rats. Yeah, that was a pretty <laughs> tense sequence. So... Uh, Definitely enjoyed it. Uh, moving on to the story. Yes. You can start. I gave it three stars. I believe I gave them four stars. Four stars for the story. Um, should I start this yeah. one? I feel this was similar to the first. A lot yes. more similar to the first compared to the second one, the second mm -hmm. one really, now that we've seen the original trilogy, the second one really feels like the odd one that, yeah. that's so different to the other two. This one was more comedic uh, and I, I preferred this to uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark, but a lot of it is similar. They're looking for something that has to do with the Bible. And, um, it's just like the first. Yeah, and it's, you know, people have been looking for it for centuries, but it's not really about the actual Holy Grail. It's about the adventure that gets mm -hmm. them there, yeah. I believe. And you see Indy, Indiana Jones also when he was little. Yeah, 
they did a flashback in the, yes. the, explaining his fear of snakes and how he got the whip and the hat. Yeah. So yeah, no, that uh, that was a cool sequence as well. Yeah. Anything else you want to add about the story that no. I didn't mention? No. No. So we just agree. I okay. Four and three stars. Yeah. So that me, uh, leaves us to our final rating, which is our enjoyment of The Last Crusade. You can start. Four stars. Four stars. You want to guess mine? Five. I gave them five stars, <laughs> indeed, yes. Uh, so, so for three times I gave it five stars. Um, uh, yeah, I really enjoyed this one. I thought this was definitely the best one out of the original trilogy, having now seen all of them once. Um, and you also seem to have really enjoyed it with four stars. Yes, I think if you uh, watch my enjoyment throughout the whole video, you see me scream, you see me uh, behind the pillowcases again. Yeah. <laughs> That's and what the Indiana Jones movies do to yeah. us. Yeah. I think the whole neighborhood heard, heard, heard me scream. But it wasn't as bad as Temple of Doom. I mean, that was no, full of, of But it. you heard me at the very last part. Great! Great! Greedy! Great! Yeah, 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 yeah. But also... <laughs> take it! But take not, it. Only, not only the scream, but it's also... It was so funny in a lot of yes, scenes. The way Connery true. and Harrison Ford interacted. That was really like well Like father and son. Yeah. Yeah. Really Junior! well played. Yeah. Dad, come up there. Yeah. No, that was really good stuff. Um, so that brings your total score to three and a half stars, and mine, if I round it up upwards, to four and a half stars. So together it would make four stars if we combine our scores. Okay. So I think that's really fair. So mine is a nine, yours is a seven, together it's an eight, pretty okay. much. Um, so. Uh, are we also going to be watching the fourth Indiana Jones movie, which came out decades later, uh, which everyone has been telling me is really bad. Really? I haven't seen it yet. It's the um, Kingdom of the Crystal Skull, Indiana Jones, the fourth one, and they're making a fifth one now. Is it also with the same uh, Yeah, and he's accent? really old now, so... Uh, is it's it also really with the whip? Yeah, and and he's making another one, and he, the guy's like 80 years old or something almost, so it's, um, oh. yeah, he's younger than that, but he's getting on. So, but are we also going to watch that one to round it off? I think we should, right, at yeah. some point. Uh, so we're um, also doing it with James Bond. Yes, we are going to be watching the third Indiana Jones movie, might make for a fun movie reaction, and maybe we even enjoy it, who knows, I mean, I only know the reputation for it being bad, but we'll be doing more movie reactions on the Bond movies, and we'll be jumping into <laughs> The Rock for Sean Connery's performance, which I just I thought know. of, because I really want to show you that movie now. If you say The Rock, I... You think of Dwayne Johnson. I, yeah, I it's think not, of Dwayne nothing Johnson, to do with him. So. No, no, no. It's, it has... I will not look it up or anything. No. I, I didn't do, also didn't do it with Indiana Jones. No. So I dived in blindness. But we're definitely watching that in between since it came out in between these movies as well. And there are also other movies I have in mind to do in this format that have to do with Bond. <laughs> uh, I won't spoil too much yet, you'll see it appear, but more ideas are there to be uh, watched in this format. Any last words before we finish off this video? No, I have to right. watch a lot of movies with you. <laughs> <laughs> in, in good time, of course, you know, yes, we're not doing popcorn. marathons. <laughs> yes. So, um, hope you guys once again enjoyed the third Indiana Jones movie reaction and see you guys in the next one. Take care guys. Bye.